Hello. So I am Sharita. I am from Oakland, California. Um, I was raised by my grandparents. I like to think of myself as the rose that grew from concrete. I'm the first of my family to graduate from college and now I am in France uh, pursuing an MBA in wine and spirits business. My late grandfather was a grape grower and it was a way for us to bond. It was a way that we connected um, even if there was complete chaos. The one thing my grandfather always said was, if you forget anything, make sure you do not forget my grapes. And until this day, I don't forget his grapes. And that is why I'm here in Burgundy, pursuing my passion in wine. As a first graduate in my family, it was always pressure to be successful or to chase my dreams. I graduated, I got a master's, I worked in corporate world, but it wasn't as fulfilling as uh, pursuing a passion. And I just was like, well, maybe I should learn a little bit more about wine, but all I knew was grapes. Uh, so I started to learn more about wine. I started to emerge myself into this industry and it became a way to bring people together. Through wine, I was able to network, bond with friends, and build relationships with family. My business partner, Shelby Woods, we created, she's a chef, we created Wine O Soul, which was a way to bring wine to marginalized communities. Uh, we learned that wine is very intimidating and we wanted it to be approachable to everyone. So by having simple pairings with food, with soul food was a great way to bring interest to wine in, the, in our community. The School of Wine and Spirit Business um, has been an amazing program so far. I've only been here for three months, but I've been exposed to so many different people, different courses, different knowledge, and I am just completely in awe. Although it has been a heavy workload, but time management and um, utilizing my resources as far as uh, leveraging my classmates and teachers have been really, really um, beneficial to me. It has been a great experience so far. So um, arriving to Dijon was uh, a culture shock for me, but it was also an amazing experience. I tried escargot for the first time. Well, for me, it was new, but it was actually really, really good. There's a list of things that I've tried for the first time that I probably would have never had in the US, but it was a great experience and I realized that I love a lot about the French culture. It has been um, amazing. Um, I've had more than 15 classes this semester um, that touched on logistics, wine and spirit marketing, um, evaluating wine and spirits, entrepreneurship, um, wine law. But I would definitely say that the harvest that um, I participated in, well, me and my class participated in, really, really was um, a treat. Um, and I actually have a scar on my finger to prove how <laughs> fun it was. Um, being at the program, I've learned a lot about myself. I've learned a lot about other cultures. So it has been a learning and growing experience for all of us in the class. Um, and just learning, teaching them my culture and them teaching me their culture and us integrating it and finding a common way to learn in the classroom. So that has been something that has really stuck out to me. The partnership um, with the Roots Fund, uh, Jeremy says, and his wife, Diana, um, it has been very, very helpful to me. They are literally my family away from home, and it has helped me to be comfortable in Dijon, learning different things about Dijon, about uh, Burgundy in general. So I'm very, very thankful for the both of them and their family. The opportunity with the Roots Fund um, BSB Foundation and Domain Dijon has 
literally changed my life to be here in this space to learn all that I have learned so far and the amount of exposure that I've had um, has been amazing and I truly want people to know that your dreams are attainable um, no matter how big how small um, continue to reach for your goals um, although circumstances may not be the best does not mean that there's going to be a great outcome so I again want to reference the rose that grew from the concrete and just wanted to say that um, everything you want is at arm's reach and continue to follow your dreams even if it's miles miles away in France in Dijon at BSB.